Okay, so there is a strategy that is used in financial services, sadly, sometimes for advisors to make money. I've seen it over a number of years from different institutions and it, it's got a, a terminology which we call churning. So what churning is, is when assets are moved for the sake of moving them to earn the advisor a fee. It's something that you want to be aware of. It's something that you want to uh, make sure that you flag early doors. So I'll give you an example of churning. If you've got a personal pension with a provider and it's doing absolutely fine, but potentially you want some investment advice to make sure that the underlying funds are suitable, then you should be able to do that. You shouldn't just have to turn um, the, the pension provider into a new one um, if there are suitable funds available. Now, don't get me wrong, there will be circumstances where uh, a financial advisor might recommend you switch from one pension provider to another, but there has to be clear justification for it. It can't be because it's easier for them or it's better for them or it meets their criteria. There has to be clear rationale for you. Now that might be there's a cost reduction, so that's a good thing. It might be that you're consolidating five or six different plans. It might be actually that the underlying investments aren't suitable and there's nothing that meets your objectives and risk. But that rationale should be really clear in a recommendation report. If an advisor just recommends you to switch from pension provider to pension provider B for the sake of it, then that's at risk of this churning process that I talked about. And clearly, if the advisor's charging initial fees, you can see why that benefits them.